Hey Gemini, welcome to your general love read. Let's see what Spirit wants to talk with you about today. Ooh. It kind of landed between the throat and the heart chakra. Okay, you may feel like you want to say something from the heart, okay, that you are not being able to say, right? We've got a little bit of trying to ground yourself, okay, a little bit of trying to um, get, it's almost like you're trying to get like your heart pumping again, like something kind of shocking sort of happened here, all right? We've got octave G and octave F, okay, and, um, hold on, I gotta look just a little bit closer here, um, we've got Venus, and you cannot really read, that's so tiny. Um, and I do not have my glasses sitting right here. I have, but I do not have my magnifying glass. Um, but we've got salt, right? We've got water. We've got apples, lemongrass, spinach, kale, broccoli. Um, again, the throat chakra. Uh, there's air here in the mind energy. So I feel that there's this, right, there's this, you want to say something, but your heart is kind of overruling you because it's like, listen, right, you cannot say what's in your mind, okay? So for the collective here, all right, we do have this awareness that you are moving, right? Okay, moving across. I'm going to move my little candle there. Moving across this uh, crossroads, this bridge. Okay, and it's an end of a cycle. So you're having to in integrate a lot. And that integration could be why you feel like you have to wear a mask. Okay, in this situation. Let's pull out a little overview. Thank you. That was a lot of overview, Spirit. Okay. Yeah. Where What you're trying to do is, okay, I'm integrating, right? I've, I've finished a cycle. But you kind of did it just kind of going through the motions. Okay. For the Andean Cross to really move you in the right direction, right, you have to drop your heart into it. You have to drop your emotions into it. But there's this energy of right. No, I just want to. I just want to move forward, right? I just want to move forward. I don't want to put my heart in this. Okay. The healing work. It feels like you're like I've done so much, but the healing work starts now. Okay. I know that's probably not what you want to hear, but the healing work starts now. Okay. For those of you that are new, I am an intuitive, okay, I do channel through the cards, so if things don't resonate, just let it go. If uh, you do feel like this resonates with you, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, because that's how new people find the channel. Okay, for those of you returning, I appreciate you. Uh, if you would like a personal reading, if you'd like to read some of my books of Woo or my more traditional, uh, I'm a certified aromatherapist and holistic practitioner, so I've got other books on micronutrients and aromatherapy. Okay, you can find all of that, my services, all down below. All right. So, we are looking at here, okay, Again, I feel like the overview here because the very first energy is magician. That is you, right? So I feel like you're trying to manifest something that you have to heal, right? You can't manifest without that healing, that integration here. 
okay? But you are pulled back, right? Again, wearing that mask, we've got the hermit energy here, okay? So you're kind of pulled back here in this hermit's energy, okay? Thank you, Spirit. Okay, but your heart says, hey, this makes me happy, okay? This makes me happy. Okay, Gemini, this makes me happy. Okay, Gemini, this makes me happy. But I am going to be very patient temperance here, okay? I'm putting all of my patience into practice. Okay, underlying here, Knight of Pentacles, right? Horse without a rider, and you just feel lost, right? Like, um, a little bit wild, a little bit bunky, like, bucking bronco. Okay, they're saying to me, I don't want to be kept. And that's okay, all right? Because no one should ever be kept. I just said this in a group that I'm in the other day. I said, why would you want to be kept, right? That doesn't feel good. You want to be loved, all right? So, the magician here, okay? Six of Cups, reunion. That's what you're trying to manifest, okay? Let's come meet up at the, right? Let's come meet up at the water. Put all, right? Look at, look at that all those ten of wands up above this mountain. Let's put all of these burdens, right, <laughs> that have been planted on top of this big dead hill. Let's put all of these burdens aside. Let's just meet up at the water, right? Just, hey, how you doing? Okay. You've pulled back though, four of wands in reverse, right? Okay. Why didn't things work out for you, right? What's, what's the reason behind this lack of celebration in your life? And again, a lot of it has to do with the fact that it was just an end of a cycle. Okay. Um, and it could be hard, right? They're showing me the t-shirt here. Okay. If you, right, if you are... Like, dang, right? Like, now I'm going to have to weave all my own t-shirts, okay? Yeah. That may make you feel kind of icky about all of those emotions. But we do, ha again, have the world here, right? You've been walking the labyrinth. You've been working on yourself. And it wasn't as if you didn't know that whatever you were dealing with, person, place, or thing, that it wasn't meant for you, okay? It's obvious. You knew something was over. You knew the cycle had run out. You just knew, okay? But what makes you happy, okay? Queen of Cups, the salmon, right? Salmon are heading home, right? To rebirth and die, okay? I want to go home. I want my reunion. I want my love. Okay. The lovers in reverse. Maybe a new perspective that you're getting on what love is. But it feels like there's an integration happening here of, right? Almost you could be in denial of what you truly love with the Queen of Cups and the Lovers in Reverse and the Four of Pentacles, right? Being in this state of protection, right? Something ended, I'm going to protect myself. Judgment here, Nine of Arrows, right? You're not even very dedicated anymore to having, it's almost like you've been like, I've got to be right. <laughs> and you're like, 
I don't even care anymore, right? It's almost like a sense of giving up. At least that's what you're saying. But I don't believe that because we've got the Knight of Swords here, right? Where you're still watching the embers of whatever burned to the ground here, okay? But you're watching it from afar, okay? Ten of Pentacles, okay? Some of you, if this Four of Wands was the end of a relationship, you're like, I just want to go home. Okay, whatever that means to you. So let's clarify here, okay? What is the reunion that you want? Okay, the tower. Okay, whatever burned to the ground here that you're watching, again, Six of Cups, clarifying the Six of Cups. It may not have been something that actually really did burn down to the ground, okay? It may have felt that way from the top of it, right? It may have felt that way in your head, right? Air sign, right? It might have felt that way, but you can see the roots are still very electrified, very on point. Okay, where your, uh, your three of cups are over there, my three of cups are over here, my head says this is over, under the surface, this big mound of death, there's something still growing underneath there. Okay, four of wands in reverse, okay, the devil in reverse. You could have been dealing with a very toxic situation and it really could have been something that oftentimes brought out the worst in you. Doesn't mean that you wouldn't want to hang on to it, right? Yeah, but again, the wheel turned, wheel of fortune on the wheel of fortune. This was meant to happen, right? I feel like whatever started all of this was a pretty entangled, complex situation. And it could have been a phone number tucked in a shirt. Right? Or a strange aroma. But whatever it was, it was a heated discussion in the night, probably that uh, made you realize that the seams were slowly coming undone here. Okay, the world. Yeah, death. Okay. <laughs> Whatever this is, it is over. Okay, whatever this four of wands was, yes, it served its time. It is over. It was toxic for you to live in it. It's done. Spirit's like, <laughs> cycle complete. Okay, it's done. Okay. But some sort of love that you feel this call to go home to, okay, is what you know makes you happy. Okay, Knight of Pentacles. Again, it could be something that you were manifesting very slowly underneath the devil in reverse four of wands in reverse, as you were recognizing, right, something, that queen of cups could even be something within you of loving yourself, where you're recognizing very slowly that there's a seed that's been planted within you that wants more, okay, that wants a greater love, okay, but the lovers in reverse, okay, two of pentacles in reverse. <clears throat> You're giving a hard no to this had nothing to do with my transformation. 
this was not that Wheel of Fortune. It's right below two Wheels of Fortune, right? Wheel of Fortune, Wheel of Fortune, Lovers in Reverse, Two of Pentacles in Reverse. No, this had nothing to do with my transformation. Zip, zero, no, nada. Right? Even though the pentacle that you were planting here with the Knight of Pentacles is working with the pentacle of something else here. Okay, person, place, or thing. Something here where, yeah, you can deny it all you want, but the mechanics are showing up that, right? This was something coming out of the cocoon. Okay, four of pentacles here, protection. That's what has led you to temperance. Okay. I'm protecting my happiness. I'm protecting myself from the sun. I'm protecting myself from any more emotions. I'm protecting myself from any more fire. I'm protecting myself from all of it. Okay. I'm pulling into this patience. Nine of swords, right? Kind of given up. Five of wands. I've just got to integrate my lessons here, right? Saturn, Lord of Karma. Okay, Saturn return. I've just got to, I've got to integrate, right? I've got to process the fact that this was toxic, and I've been wearing a mask, that this was a cycle that was meant for me. Okay, the hawk here, knight of swords, the high priestess. Okay. There's still a need to want to know. Even if this lover's Two of Pentacles had nothing to do with all of this. You're like, God, I just wish I knew, right? So you're watching it. Ten of Pentacles. <laughs> Two of Cups and the Lovers. Yeah, there's a part of you that's like, I know right? There's the sun, the strength. I know this makes me happy. I know that it would probably make me feel secure, but I've got to take some time here, okay? So, okay, tell me here about this Six of Cups. The roots, the six of cups. The top here is seven of cups. Okay, so it could have been, right, uh, that ab above the surface you had a lot going on. Okay, again, yes. Okay. And we've got here, all right, the world, the ace of swords, the Queen of Swords, right? It's almost like everything was ending here and there was a bomb dropped and everything's just kind of being cut out here. Okay, Queen of Swords. Yep. That pushed that Hermit's energy, right? That's what pushed this whole top up here, right? What was this truth? What was the truth? Was it just the ending? Okay. Page of Cups in reverse. Queen of Wands. And the star. Again, the end here could have happened because you found out, right? Like 
somebody had different wishes than you. Okay. And this ending, right? The bottom here, again, six of cups, right? Somebody's still here in the motion, the emotions, all right? Um, but it was toxic, and the wheel turned, and it's done, okay? Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> Queen of Cups, okay? You may not even have met someone new yet, but under all of this emotions, buried, very deep here, there's some love. Okay, yeah, there we go. Seven of Swords, okay? I hold it in secret. I've housed it over here. No one can see it. And yet here's this love, right? Knight of Pentacles. I've been manifesting it, but from a distance, okay? And they're singing that song to me, but I don't even know it. I just know the one line. From a distance. I don't know. Okay, if you know that song, put it down below or go listen to the lyrics. Okay, again. From a distance. Five of Pentacles. Okay. If you are talking to this person, there's not a lot of emotions, right? There's a teeny tiny bit of, of water here, right? Almost like a little bit of a fishing hole, right? And this is on that salmon. Looking for signs of what I want, what my home space is. Okay. Two of pentacles in reverse. Okay. Hangman in reverse. It could have been that it made you too impatient. Okay. It made you feel all of this fire and uh, this deep cord connected to you and impatient and you were tr struggling to keep it right hidden. Yeah, like six of swords, right? It, it just, you couldn't transition through that. So you moved into temperance here. Yeah, okay. The devil, which in this deck is the liar, right? I'm running away from this. <laughs> there I go, right? Look at him, he's tiptoeing across the wood. I'm running away from this, right? But where am I running to? This house with no walls, right? I'm running away to this place that I say I'm protected in. But I'm not because down here we see that you're still watching it. Okay. The lesson here, five of wands. Okay. Seven of wands. Like you might have all these people that you're talking to, right? And they're like talking to this dragon and they're like, okay. Right. We saw where you've like burn shit down okay where's the emotion right you don't burn shit down if you don't have any emotion in it and you're like no i didn't have any emotion i'm a dragon and they're like yeah there was emotion no i don't have any emotion i'm a dragon and they're like okay can we talk right and you're like no right but two of cups and the lovers okay two of cups and the lovers crossed by ace of cups an energy that you are mirroring in all of this okay underlying that's what caused the end okay everything that came to the end was because of something that you have underlying here emotionally that you're like no i don't and yet you do okay so let's go ahead and let's close it off here all right 
it with a little oracle card and then I'm going to move over to Patreon and see what else Spirit wants to talk about a little more intimately on this. Okay, 3-3. Three, three. Increase your frequency, higher conscious awareness, right? Your angels are like, dude, you can do, right? Dudes and babes, you can do, say, be, whatever you want. But when it comes to push comes to shove, and it's for your best interest, and it's time to heal, Spirit's like, we're going to push you, right? Bottom here is cosmos, okay, and past lives. This is definitely, right, Saturn, Lord of Cosmos, karma, right, lessons, uh, coming in to say it's time to create a new and pushing you into it. All right, so I hope that this helps you, Gemini, if this is where we leave it. Don't forget to click on that notification bell so that you know when I post other videos. Um, if you are heading over to Patreon, my Patreon program is you pay what you feel like you can. So that, oh, did you see that? Somebody needed to know that so that you can go ahead and access if you need to. And I hope to see you guys there. All right, link is down below. Bye.